The group Sacramento Steps Forward is looking for more volunteers for this year's homeless count. They need at least 500 people to help out, and this count has been postponed a few times now because of the pandemic. KCRA3's Maricela de la Cruz tells us more about why the count is so important. As Sacramento Steps Forward gears up for the new point-in-time homeless count, more volunteers are needed. So I think we're going to find out that there are different challenges uh, during after this pandemic, not being able to do the count for the last two years. This is why it's critical to get so many volunteers to participate. The results of this count will be used to help improve homelessness program services and resources. Advocates are looking forward to engagement between residents and the homeless community. It really gives the community and volunteers an opportunity to, to understand homelessness in a different way and um, have an opportunity to maybe um, interact and, and have conversations with people who are experiencing homelessness. Which many insist is necessary to truly get to the root of the problem. You gotta be willing to take your time with them, help them, give them suggestions, talk to them, get to know them. Don't just, you know, shoot the bullet and expect it to hit the target right away because every now and then you're gonna miss. Mark says he was homeless for nine years, up until a few weeks ago. And now that he's off the streets, he's also advocating for connection and understanding. When I was down and I couldn't ask for it, people came to me and asked me, hey, do you need help? We need more of those people that are willing to help the homeless, not just criticize the homeless. And has a message for residents who are against temporary homeless camps or shelters for this community. I don't think the homeless is dangerous. You got some that are, yes, I will agree with you, because they are mentally unstable. Some might be psychotic, some might be schizoaffective, some might be schizophrenia. This year's point in time count is happening on February 23rd and 24th. And advocates and city leaders believe that this count will reveal more than the 5,500 homeless individuals that were counted in 2019. In Sacramento, Maricela de la Cruz, KCRA 3 News. And Sacramento Steps Forward says they need at least 25 more volunteers. Those interested have to be 18 years and older, fully vaccinated, and you must take training. You can sign up at sacramentostepsforward.org.